Right, imagine a fish that looks like polished armour plate and grows longer than I am tall. That's the Arapaima, a river giant from the Amazon. And here's the part I love, it changes colour as it grows, like a living progress bar for maturity. When Arapaimas are young, they're silver grey, clean, understated, almost minimalistic. That silver acts like camouflage in murky shallows, scattering light so predators don't get a neat outline. You could swim past one and never notice, but give it years. And yes, these fish can live for decades, and the palette upgrades. The big adults start to shimmer with metallic reds and greens, especially flaring near the tail. Under sunlight, each scale catches light like a tiny CD, iridescent, layered, reflected. So why the glow-up? Partly size changes the rules. When you're massive and armoured, hiding matters less. Instead, that red-green halo becomes a signal, power, age, territory. And in the tannin-stained Amazon, reds travel differently through water. Those hues can pop at close range, while fading at distance. It's stealth and statement in one. Look closely at the tail on a mature arapaima. The scales transition from muted grey to a confetti of metallic reds, like embers drifting into water. Greens appear along the flanks, a thin sheen that shifts when the fish turns. It's not paint, it's physics, microscopic layers in the scales, bending light. Here's the neat bit. The change isn't overnight. Season by season, as the fish bulks up on a flood pulse diet, new scales grow thicker, pigment cells deepen, and the reflective layers stack. Juvenile mist becomes adult fire. So, if you ever see one, silver grey, you're looking at youth. Red and green, especially near the tail. That's an elder of the river, advertising its status with every flick. From monochrome to metallic. An evolution written on armour. The Arapaima doesn't just survive the Amazon. It wears it.